Hi, this is Rick Itzkowich and I'm the LinkedIn guy. And in this uh, video, I am going to answer the question that I've been asked recently, which is, okay, how do I connect with companies inside of LinkedIn? And uh, well, let's start out with the concept that you don't connect to companies, you connect to people inside of companies. And that's an important distinction to uh, keep in mind because LinkedIn is all about relationships and all about connections. So um, you will be connecting with people inside of companies. So to do that, we are here on the home page. Let's go to the advanced search feature of LinkedIn. And uh, there's many very different ways that you can search on LinkedIn. Uh, in this screen, we are going to screen by company. Let's see IBM. Uh, in here you have a filter of current and past. Let's just make it current and then title. Let's do it in quotations VP of sales, VP sales. The reason you want to put it in quotations is because then it has VP sales rather than just VP and or sales. All right, and let's see what we get. When we do the search, we have 437 results. All right, so uh, these are 437 results of people who are working currently at IBM and have the title of Vice President of Sales, either in the current capacity or past. So as we can see, some of the people here, let's see, uh, Ron, Ronald Putt is Vice President of Sales at Telelogic, an IBM company. Uh, in here, Enrique Rodriguez, Vice President of Sales and Operations at IBM Corporation, etc. So this one, Michael Connolly, Vice President of Sales, Orange County, California. So uh, you can see that we have 437 people. Now further here, what you can do is uh, LinkedIn gives you the ability to slice and dice the data to even refine it further because that's a lot of people so now what you want to do is you want to start drilling down if you don't yet have a name of the person that you want to connect to on link uh, on LinkedIn uh, then uh, what you the first thing to do is to get the name of that person now you may start the conversation with people that are either your first degree connections which in this case I don't have any uh, meaning I cannot directly contact any people in my network that fit the criteria of president of sales or vice president of sales of IBM but I do have second degree connections okay as we've seen most of them and also group members now here's one advantage of uh, having somebody as a group member that if I target the people that are group members okay what I can do is I can connect directly I can send them a message because we're part of the same group you see on LinkedIn you can only connect with people that you are directly connected with or if you are part of the same group and then you can send them a message because you're part of the same group there's a third message which has to do with in mails especially if you're a paid account but for right now I'm not gonna focus on that so uh, what I can do is if I can target my second degree connections and group members then uh, I can contact them directly but I can also ask whoever it is that I'm connected to for an introduction to that particular person you see so these people that we have a shared connections are people that are connected to uh, the people and they're connected to me so they can act as a go-between to receive an introduction to that person so I can have a conversation or I can have a direct message to them because we are part of the same group so uh, people who are part of the same group okay what I'll do is I can send them directly uh, a message or go through a connection and uh, the people who are not part of the same group then I would have to go through an individual so um, let me back off and let's go back to the search and in this time I am gonna put only IBM okay people that are current and people that are my first degree connections let's see if I have any I believe that I saw that I had four alright so I have four people that are in my first degree connections which mean I can contact them directly I may or may not know them well depending on what your uh, philosophy is for connecting with people but I can start conversations with these people and ask them for introductions to some of the VP sales that uh, showed earlier so um, that's how you connect with people on LinkedIn 
you uh, companies I mean what you do is you target the company that you want to connect with and then once you have the company then find some of the individuals inside of the company that are in your network or find the names of the people you want to be connected inside of LinkedIn and either directly connect to them if you're part of groups and or go through a go-between to get connected to them so there you have it that's how you connect to people inside of companies using LinkedIn. I hope that you've uh, found this segment valuable. And if you have any questions, feel free to contact me at rick at productivelearning.com. Enjoy an extraordinary day.